guys doing out here today? Well, it's a uh, it's a fundraiser for the election. Uh, Grove for Sheriff, as you can see in the background, uh, we're uh, some friends and family getting together out here, and uh, we've got some auction items out tonight. Uh, old antique refrigerator and ice box, I guess, and plenty of stuff donated by a lot of uh, people that uh, trying to get some money together for uh, the uh, election. Just kind of supporters just donated some of this stuff. It is, yeah. Uh, you know, obviously it uh, takes a lot of money, and, and we're uh, trying to get things together and so we can uh, start on our uh, different uh, plans for uh, advertisements and stuff like that. But uh, signs are out. Uh, getting a bunch of people out tonight to uh, pick up some signs and stuff like that, too. So. Kind of nervous, nervous about it coming up here in the next You know what? Yeah, you know, I, I think probably the biggest part of it uh, is over with, uh, with the primary. Uh, Bill Pugh was a, a great uh, candidate uh, and uh, opponent for me, and uh, we've talked since the election. Everything's uh, good with us. We're, uh, you know, our party is uh, working hard to try to get uh, the election over with, and uh, come November 6th, uh, hopefully... Uh, yeah, the votes will go in my favor. Uh, I think I got a lot to offer the uh, citizens of uh, Buchanan County, and you know, as things go on, uh, uh, I think that they'll see that if they uh, choose me, that they made the right choice. Any plans for the next two months about how to, I guess, maybe sway some voters get out there? Well, uh, it's know? uh, it's about a little less than 60 days out, and I've already started. Uh, I'm out walking quite a bit. Uh, um, got. Uh, like I said, about uh, 300 signs uh, just came in that I put out, uh, maybe a little less than half of them. Uh, got a lot more to put out. Um, I'm going to start walking the neighborhoods again. So they're going to see my face out on the, uh, on the streets and uh, see the black pickup out with the Grover Sheriff signs on it. You know, I just, uh, uh, fortunately, I, I've got the time to, to spend to get out and campaign and uh, talk to people and let them know that uh, who I am and what I stand for and you know the uh, honesty integrity is uh, unwavering uh, you know I'm here for the long run so I have some signs being taken I'm sorry I do you still have signs being taken too uh, there have been a couple that have been moved yeah. they really haven't been taken uh, I've seen of them in a cup put down and in the bushes behind some uh, of my uh, my opponent signs and stuff like that, but uh, I haven't uh, had any that were stolen as of recent. But uh, that was a pro big problem in the primary. I had a lot of signs taken. Um, I know that uh, there's another candidate out there. I think PJ has uh, uh, had lost some signs, um, and you know, I, who knows where that comes from? If it's kids doing that. Uh, or what? Let's hope that that's who it is. I mean, uh, you'd hate to think that uh, another political candidate uh, or their uh, family would do something like that. But uh, uh, you know, I'm I'm uh, I'm fairly confident that uh, things will go uh, to the benefit of the of the citizens of Buchanan County if uh, if they choose me. Anything else? Well, uh, I hope everybody gets out to vote November sixth. I'd like to have their support and vote on November 6th. That's, uh, uh, I have the uh, education and the, the experience that uh, is unmatched in the sheriff's office, and uh, I'm, I'm ready for the, for the uh, new job.